Lisa Howe brings her smile on patrol every evening. You don't have to be mean in order to enforce the law. He got this Montgomery County deputy in trouble in the Army. I can't recall how many push-ups I did through basic training for smiling. Still, she won the Bronze Star in Operation Desert Storm and drove heavy equipment through combat zones. Every possibility of me not going home, just like my buddy next to me. But there was one job she couldn't do. You know, I wanted to drive the tank when we were up there and they wouldn't let me in. <laughs> Military rules prohibited women from combat roles, like driving a tank. I never did understand why women weren't allowed the same opportunities as everybody else. It now appears that's changing. The military is opening new combat positions to women, some as early as this year. We found mixed opinions on that change around Fort Campbell, including these at Bo's Barbershop. If the person is qualified, male or female, doesn't matter, if they're qualified to do the job, let them do the job. Guys have this natural, you know, reaction to help a female first. When you do that overseas, you know, you might be leaving someone you know, that you're not supposed to be leaving to help defend a girl. It's a concern Howell has heard before, but she points out... Probably 10-8. Women are already serving on the front lines of law enforcement. You know, we have women in political positions of power, women in power positions all throughout the private sector of industry. So why shouldn't women be wherever else they want to be?